Hey, welcome to the first collaboration with the Fingernail Fixer and BFF Mel. Mel is Tips of the Trade. Many of you may recognize her from Facebook and Instagram. For her first video, she's going to show a marbling technique that's been highly requested online. This nail is done with CND brand shellac, two coats of bicycle yellow, and then a coat of top coat applied. Make sure that the top coat is not yet cured. Mel is placing a curved line of CND shellac cream puff, making sure to use a medium pressure on the striping brush so that you're depositing enough color into the top coat on top of the line. And you can see some of the color kind of starting to spread out on the nail, and that is what you're wanting to achieve. You want that nice fluidity that only the top coat can give you. You want to make sure that you're choosing contrasting colors when you do this. You're going to alternate between a couple different colors for your arches. It's going to look better if you do the lines in a curve. It's not necessary for the curves to be perfect. So just go at it, don't be nervous, and just play. It's going to be fun no matter what. The better your colors contrast, the easier it's going to be to see the design and the more fun it will be. When you get comfortable with it, you can even start throwing in some additives and some glitter. You can see she's kind of touching back up any of the places that the line thinned out too much. Again, make sure you're using a nice medium pressure with that striping brush and or going back in so that you deposit enough color to create the look. Now she's going to begin at the center of the arches and drag straight out taking the stripe all the way to the opposite edge of the nail that it's headed towards. Make sure you're only pulling outwards for this specific design, not coming back in and pulling inwards every other. So start at the center of your arches and pull straight out going towards the opposite edge of the nail that you start at. Kind of take a look at your finished result. If you want to, you can go back in and pull a few more out if it feels like you have a really open space. And this is a design that's meant for you to interpret however you like. Do it with different colors, do it with different styles, and just have lots of fun. Make sure once you're finished with the marble that you cure for two minutes and top coat the entire design. Cure that for two minutes and you're good to go. Thanks! Have fun!